Hey, lo, hello, uh, greetings and hello to all of you on the internet online right now. This, this is the worst intro to a video I've ever done, so... So it's been a while since we made a video, but we're back and um, it's a new year, it's a new decade which is kind of crazy when you think about it. And I'm thinking about it, so... The good thing is though, this is like a, a proper decade, it's like the 20s, because the other ones were like, I don't even know what you call them, like the, the 2000s, the noughties, the, the 10s, like whatever. This is a proper decade because it's the 20s. This year we have a lot of stuff planned, we had a little vision meeting at the start of our year with the team, and we planned out a few things that we're going to be doing the first half of this year, we're going to be touring like crazy, all kinds of different places, and the back half of the year we're going to be doing some new projects and launching a few new things. Um, so watch this space for all of that stuff. But we actually quietly launched a couple of new things, which is the reason I'm making this video, is a little update. So the first of these two things is we launched a Discord server, which will mean more to some people than others, but basically Discord, for those who don't know, is an online app group chat platform type thing which is based around teams it actually started as a app used for gamers so that they can chat while they're playing a certain game build a community around that kind of thing and if you've ever used something like slack it's a similar kind of vibe to that it's like an online chat space with different categories that focus on different topics and people have started discord servers for all kinds of things now it's not just gaming you can do servers around music production or fans of a certain kind of film or even fans of a certain band or any of that kind of stuff so i was trying to find a discord server for kind of christian artists and creators and just a place that we can like chat and engage and build community online and i couldn't really find one so uh we made one and it is now live we launched it in around the middle of December, and it was a bit of an experiment. I just set one up, put the link out on Instagram, and I was like, okay guys, here's this thing. I don't know if anyone's gonna use it. And 250 people joined in like two days. And it's been so much fun because we've been connecting with creators and artists and all kinds of different people. So we have graphic designers, we have songwriters, we have game designers, we have illustrators. There's like so many different people and at all different levels. Some of them are, you know, people who this is their job and their profession. Some of them are just starting to study this kind of stuff. So we have the general chat where we just generally chat. We have the memes channel, which has been amazing actually. We've had some high quality memes posted in this channel and it has blessed me in my ministry and uh, filled my heart with joy. So, and all kinds of different things. A place to share prayer requests, a place that we can share testimonies and praise reports of cool things that have been happening in our life. Even just a few weeks in, it's been really good fun. We've had so many good conversations on there and interesting topics. We've had collaborations happening between different types of artists. We haven't mentioned about it on YouTube, so I wanted to do that and invite you guys, if you're watching, if you consider yourself a Christian creator or artist, or even you're just interested in that and you want to have a conversation and have some community with those kind of people, then I want to invite you to join. It's totally free. You can get the app on your phone or on desktop and join in the conversations, a lot of fun. And the second thing I wanted to mention is something that actually came out of the Discord server and one of the conversations we were having was this idea of a creative project that we can all work on together. And we're calling it the Set Sail Creative Project, SSCP. And the concept is very simple. We share a topic, just a simple theme, maybe it's a Bible verse or a word, and we invite people all around the world, whatever kind of creative industry you're involved in or thing that you do, to respond to this verse or theme and then share the work with the hashtag SSCP followed by whatever the theme of the month is. Um, and it may not be every month. I'm not going to commit to that exactly, but we're going to aim to be roughly every month. So we demoed this out with a advent themed project through December. Um, people shared their work with the hashtag SSCP advent and we had some amazing stuff come through. We had some awesome songs, we had illustrations, we had posters, we had all kinds of stuff, videos, and um, I tried to collect all of those things that were made and share them on our website. So if you go to timetosetsail.com and see our blog, you will find the whole collection of things that people made for that project. And it was so fun to just unpack this verse together and see the same thing from all different people's perspectives and kind of this whole, I don't know, seeing it all come together just seemed really cool. And um, it was a really great way to respond and to create 
and invite people to get involved in something from all around the world. So we're doing it again. Uh, we just launched the second Set Sail Creative project and the theme is rest. But let me just pull up the Instagram post so I can actually quote this correctly. Yeah, so the theme is rest and the scripture is Matthew 11, 28 to 30, which is the words of Jesus. He says, come to me all who labor and are heavy laden and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me for I'm gentle and lowly in heart and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. And so I wanted to invite you guys, we're running this until the end of January, which is the 30, the 31st of January. So whatever kind of creative thing it is that you do, we want to invite you to just do that in response to this theme of rest. You can use the scripture like direct word for word if you want, or that might just be an inspiration for you to do something else. But try and create around this theme of rest and share your work with the hashtag SSCP rest. And I'm going to kind of collect all of those projects together and post them again on our website in a big feature on rest that we do with artwork from people all around the world. And so that's it. Simple video. Just wanted to give a little update, but um, hope you guys are having a great start of 2020. And we have a bunch of videos in the pipeline. They'll be coming soon to our YouTube channel. Uh, in the meantime, you can um, do all those things that people tell you to do at the end of videos, uh, like it and uh, smash different buttons or, you know, uh, the end. Thank you.